Today we're going to take a look at the Kodiak E-Coat Disc Brake Kit, 13-inch rotors, 8 on 6 and a half inch bolt pattern for 7,200 pound dexter axles. Now these brake assemblies will make it easy to change from an idler axle to a disc brake axle. Disc brakes will deliver better performance than drum brakes, gives you more consistent stopping even at highway speeds, and also dramatically shorter stopping distances. Also the maintenance costs are lower than for drum brakes because you have fewer moving parts to maintain, repair, or replace. This kit will include everything for two, everything here on the table. It's two full brake assemblies. You get the two E-coated cast iron rotors, the two E-coated cast iron calipers with the four stainless steel caliper mounting bolts, and the two E-coated ductile iron caliper mounting brackets. The E-coat finish on these parts will provide corrosion resistance for fresh water and limited salt water use. The rotors, they're a slip-on cast iron over the hub rotor. They fit over your standard idler hub and they're held in place by the wheel and the wheel bolts. They do remove easily for maintenance, plus there's no need to replace your entire hub and rotor assembly if only your hub or rotor becomes damaged. It does increase your distance from hub face to hub face of about a half an inch. The vented design on these rotors will effectively dissipate heat, which helps prevent any heat-related damage. And the calipers, they are a cast iron caliper. They are self-adjusting for smooth equal braking. They also are E-coated. The cast iron construction does not flex like aluminum. These calipers are a low drag design, which means it retracts the piston further in than other calipers for a cooler running brake. Just want to turn this around. We're going to take the pad out. I just want to show you the pistons in it. They are a silver cadmium plated piston. They are two and a half inches in diameter, which is about 30% larger than other brands, so it gives you more braking torque than the competition. The brake pads that come with them are the high performance semi metallic brake pads. <coughs> Now the mounting brackets, they are made of a ductile iron material. They are also E-coated. They provide strength and durability. The side support design of them ensures that the load is placed on the whole bracket, not just the bolts. They do have extra embossing for additional thread contact, ensures a nice tight, secure mounting for the caliper guide bolts. And if you notice, they're designed to fit on a four bolt brake flange mounting configuration. Now also with this, you will need hydraulic brake actuator and brake lines. We do sell those separately on our website. They will be required for the brakes to be activated. You just want to make sure those parts, the actuator and the lines, will have at least a 1500 PSI rating. These parts are made in the USA. Again, this is designed to fit a 7200 pound Dexter axle with the number 42 spindle. The wheel size that will fit on these is 16 inches and larger. The bolt pattern I mentioned is an 8 on 6 and a half inch bolt pattern. Wheel bolt diameter is a 9 16 of an inch. And the whole rotor diameter from edge to edge is 13 inches. But that should do it for the review on the Kodiak E-Coat Disc Brake Kit, 13-inch rotors, 8 on 6.5 inch bolt pattern for a 7,200-pound Dexter axle. Thanks for watching. Click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com and leave us a comment if you have any questions.